Ah, hello there, minions. Today we're going to talk about a rather infamous director by the name of Edward J. Wood. Mr. Wood was known for making several very bad movies. However, were they really that bad? The most infamous movie of all time is his masterpiece, Plan 9 from Outer Space, which concerns aliens coming here and resurrecting the dead to stomp out humanity to prevent them from discovering a rare element that occurs in sunshine that they would use to destroy other worlds. That's the premise, anyway. This film was made with virtually no budget. The sets are apparently and obviously made of cardboard. The acting is stilted and not very good. There wasn't much of a script. A lot of it was just Ed Wood sitting in a director's chair telling actors what to say off camera. The movie is infamous, and I'm sure you've heard it, and I'm sure you've heard that it's the worst movie ever made. And I'm going to challenge you today with the notion that it is not the worst movie ever filmed. That is because, despite all of its lack of budget, all of its lack of apparent talent, the movie, maybe not in the way originally intended, is still very enjoyable and a good time to watch. And you can find that out for yourself in just a matter of moments when we present to you Plan 9 from Outer Space. I want you to keep this in mind as you're watching this film. As you're laughing and enjoying the sheer stupidity of it, think of how much better this is than some more recent movies that have had huge production values and named celebrity stars that just don't get it. Their movies fail completely because they're badly written, badly performed, and just based on a terrible premise. These modern films are not nearly as enjoyable or laughable as Plan 9. So don't take my word for it. Watch the film and see for yourself. Plan 9 from outer space.